Except in Walmart, Ron speaking. How can I help you? Hi, how are you? Good, thank you. I'm not doing too well right now. I have purchased um, an electric blanket. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't know if the wiring came loose. Um, I had it turned up, you know, it was cold. I had it turned up all the way, and the wiring had come loose, or come out of the bottom of the blanket. Yes, sir. And somehow coiled on my foot. Now, my right foot, uh, my toes, are it melted them together, and I don't know what to do. I'm nervous about this. Okay, well, sir, if you can, we need you to bring that item back. I can do that. With the receipt? Do you have the receipt for it? I have everything. The packaging, the receipt, everything. I never throw anything away in case something... Okay. And when you come in, we'll fill out a report. Now, I don't know if I can even put my socks on my right foot. What happened was the coil... I felt something on my foot, like a, something wrapped around my toes, and... I yelled, ah, in the middle of the night because it burned so bad, and I looked, and they're melted together. I can't even pull them apart. So I don't want to put a sock over top of them. I don't know what to do. Well, sir, that, that would be something that you'd have to make that decision, okay, as far as if you need any medical attention or anything like that. Uh, is there any way maybe if I came in and met with you in an office, maybe you could help me pull my toes apart to help well, me? That's right. No, I wouldn't be able to do that, sir. I, you know, I'm, I'm, I can understand your predicament, but I, I'm not a, a medical t trained in medicine, so that would have to be someone that a me medical doctor would do. Okay, well, I mean, just between you and I, if you just pulled them apart, I would be fine with that. I won't tell anybody. Just I, the, the sorry, I can't do that, sir, unfortunately. And I, again, I, I understand you have to make a decision on how you want to handle that. Well, my predicament is now I'm stuck with a webbed foot from this blanket that you sold me. What am I to do? Okay, well, sir, that would be something. That's a decision you have to make. I can't, do it. I can't advise you on something like that. I can only advise you on what we can do, sir, it's at our store. Now, do you, if I come in, maybe you could put my foot in one of those um, things. You fill it up with water and some salt, and it warms the foot up. And yes, maybe... sir, I can't, I can't give you any medical attention, sir. I'm not a medical doctor. That would be something you'd have to go to a doctor for, uh, or, you know, call a doctor, ask them for their advice. Right. Well, getting back to the, the electric blanket that I purchased, um, mm -hmm. I'll bring that in to get a refund. Maybe you could sneak me in the back room and not tell anybody and just pull my toes apart really quick and then I'll just go about my business. Okay, sir. I, I can't really do that, sir. Could you at least look at my toes and tell me what to do? No, sir. I can't do that, sir. I can't give you any medical advice, sir. I'm not a, a medical doctor. Well, now I'm stuck with the webbed foot from the blanket that you sold me and I'm very upset about this. I understand that, sir. I can understand. Uh, but it's not something, sir, that I can treat. I don't appreciate the treatment that I'm getting from you or anybody at this location. Now, look, what if you had a webbed foot? What would you do from I a blood? I would call a doctor, sir. I would call a doctor and get medical attention. That's what I would do. But you have to make your own decision. Oh, will you at least give me my money back for the blanket? That's our policy. We would give you a refund. Now, if I come up to the front counter and return it and get a full refund, could you come out to assist me? I'll come in without a shoe on, and you can at least look down at my foot and say, hey, this is what you need to do. Sir, I can't really give you any medical advice, sir. Have you ever seen a webbed foot before? No, sir, I haven't. That's why I'm not a medical doctor, sir. That's why I could never give you any medical advice. Do you have webbed feet? No, sir, I don't. All right, thank you. You're welcome. Bye.